Hi there. My name is Aaron Landerman. I'm a professor of electrical and computer engineering at Georgia Tech, and like some other professors, I became an accidental YouTuber as a result of the COVID-19 pandemic. University campuses across the country closed up shop. And suddenly, instead of lecturing in classrooms like this, professors found themselves lecturing in studios like this. Most professors basically just record their lecture as they've always given it, either scribbling on some substitute for a whiteboard or talking to PowerPoint slides, and they just dump that raw footage online without any editing. Now, these efforts are definitely appreciated. Having these lectures, even in a crude format, is definitely better than not having them at all but it fails to take advantage of the particular affordances of the video lecture format. The laptop screen is a fundamentally different medium than a live lecture hall, and it needs to be treated as such. I haven't seen that many professors who put the level of effort into editing their videos that I put into mine, but there are three professors that came across my radar screen as doing a great job on this, and I wanted to send you their way. The first is Robert Fruwald, a professor of music at Southeast Missouri State University. He currently only has 124 subscribers, and he deserves 100 times that many. In particular, he has this playlist of music theory videos called Music as Pattern. If you're a fan of Rick Beato or Adam Neely or 12 Tone, you definitely need to check this out. The second is Michael Clarkson, a senior lecturer of computer science at Cornell. I'm about halfway through his lecture series on OCaml programming, and he also has a lecture series on automated proof techniques for computer programs. So if you're into computer science, you should definitely go subscribe to his channel. The third professor I want to mention is Matthew Bird of the Rhode Island School of Design. Professor Bird has a playlist for his History of Industrial Design class. And I binge-watched the entire thing like it was the latest season of Stranger Things. I found myself listening to a lecture on the history of plywood and being totally riveted. Anyway, if you know of another professor that should be on this list in terms of somebody who hasn't just made great lectures, but who really has taken advantage of the YouTube medium, leave a comment about it below.